In this video, I'm going to show you sample question and answers related to differentiation on logarithm and exponential functions. Okay, some of the important things that you need to know in, for this topic. The first is the general formula of uh, differentiation of logarithm function. If y is equal to log x, then dy dx, what we do is to invert the x here. So it become 1 over x. For exponential function, if we are given y equals to e to the power x, then dy dx, we copy back the e to the power of x. Okay? So let's look at sample question. Part A, we are asked to differentiate the function log 3 plus log 7x squared minus e to the power negative x. So what we do is to differentiate this function, the first one is log 3. Now since there is no x, we can just ignore it. Okay. So for log 7x squared, so what we do is when we differentiate log, we have to invert the 7x squared. So we will write as 1 over 7x squared. Then followed by differentiation of 7x squared. So when we differentiate 7x squared, we will take 2 times 7 equals to 14. So we have 14x minus differentiation of e to the power negative x. We copy the e to the power negative x again. Then we differentiate the power negative x will give us negative 1. So from here when we simplify, so 7 and 14 we can cancel remainder 2 here. Alright, and then x and x square we can also cancel. So therefore, we will get uh, 1 times remainder 2 here. So 2, we will write down as 2. And then x and x square we cancel remainder 1 more x as the denominator. Plus, here we have negative 1 times negative. So the answer will be positive. So e to the power negative x, we will copy back again here. So therefore, the answer is 2 over x plus e to the power negative x. So for part B, we are asked to find the second degree derivative. So second degree derivative means you have to differentiate two times, okay? For the function fx equals to 8x squared plus e to the power negative x minus log 2x. So how to differentiate this function? Now for this function, we will do one by one. So start off with 8x squared when we differentiate 8x squared, so 2 times 8 will be 16. And then power minus 1, remainder 1 more here, so we write as 16x. Plus, now e to the power negative x, we copy back e to the power negative x. Then differentiate negative x will give us negative 1. So minus log 2x, will, we will write as 1 over 2x first. Then followed by differentiation of 2x will give us 2. So from here when we simplify, the 2 and 2 we can cancel. So we will get 16x, we copy again. Negative 1 times e to the power negative x, the answer is negative e negative x. Minus, so cancel the 2, we have 1 over x. Now before we find the second derivative, so what we do is the 1 over x, we have to move x to the top, shift it to the top. So we will get 16x minus e to the power negative x. So x to the power 1, if we move it to the top, we will get x to the power of negative 1. So from here, when we differentiate the second time, 16x will give us 16. When we differentiate e to the power negative x, we copy back again. Then don't forget to differentiate the power negative x will give us negative 1. Alright? Minus, differentiate x to the power negative 1, we'll bring the power down. So we'll get negative 1 times x, then the power minus 1. Negative 1 minus 1 will give us negative 2. So from here, when we simplify further, so 16, we copy back again. Negative 1 times negative will be positive e to the power negative x. Negative times negative 1 will be equals to positive times x. We have x. Then the power negative 2, we just copy again. So this will be the second degree derivative. Okay?